children with communication and language disorders usually the perception is that because they can't speak they can't think that's a misconception only because i don't have a language to express what they want doesn't mean i don't feel it here and feel it here so lot of your thinking your feeling your behavior has a component of language to it because it is not expressed it is not known they are able to think and feel as deeply as us it's just that they don't have the vehicle through which they can express this to the world and this deficit this gap creates lot of uh, frustration lot of discomfort lot of uh, unsettling feeling of not able to reach out to people and that's why a lot of misbehavior start from this deficit of language uh, so what has to be done there are some children who are verbal sometimes they are non verbal sometimes they have speech but they cannot use it to communicate well so if you want a child to pick up language don't rely on just speech therapy or just waiting for the youtube to do the magic make the language come alive whatever it need not be english it could be any language any mother tongue make sure uh, because another thing that i have noticed is because when the child is not able to express they forget the fact that child can hear and they stop talking they make it very easy they just gestures or the ch- before the child can communicate little bit things are done for him so the child never has a need to tap into his ability to speak so remember one thing he is hearing everything whenever he gets the speech all the language that is spoken around will be registered and it will come out make sure that you talk to the child looking into the eyes speak in complete sentences in real life we don't speak in complete sentences because that is how the function will talk it is just for survival we just uh, use it but when you're talking to a child with learning problems or speech problems make sure every sentence is complete and the vocabulary is rich uh, this is true for even other children you know we tend to use colloquial language baby talk zero to between the zero to six year there is a quality of mind called absorbent mind it like a sponge anything that is put around it will be absorbed unconsciously so what that is why we pick up our mother tongue without having a tutor around if there are two languages alive in the environment we pick up both the languages it just that whatever is alive is imbibed from 0 to 6 or 0 to 8 years